So what happens next? Hmm. Well, as we've said before, the power to choose is one of God's greatest gifts to us. And you see, with His guidance, we can make the proper decisions all the time. It may be hard, it may be tough, but in the end, the power to make our lives better is in our hands. Hmm. So let's see what some young people from your schools would have to say about what they would do in some situations. What happens next? Hi, we're here on What Happens Next, and for our problem today, the question is, if two of your friends got into an argument and you were close to the both of them, would you, letter A, side with the one closer to you, letter S, would you leave them to work it out on their own, letter Q, would you try to make peace between them? Or letter W, would you join in the fight? What happens next? All right, we're here with our first correspondent for What Happens Next, and her name is... Maria Fatima Nifas from Fort St. Angela. Hi, Maria Fatima. Hi. Let's find out what her answer is. Letter A, letter S, letter Q, or letter W? My answer is letter Q, which is trying to patch up things with my close friends without taking sides. I chose this answer because for me, it is the best thing to do and it is the right thing to do. Um, for me, as a good friend, and I am concerned with them, so it is best to give advices to both of them without taking sides because I'm not even involved in the situation, so I think it's best to try to enlighten them with my advices. Alright. Hindi ka, hindi ka magsusumbong sa teacher mo. I wouldn't do that. <laughs> okay, thank you, Maria Fatima. Stay tuned for what happens next. Okay, and for our next correspondent, we have... <laughs> What's your name? I'm Jillian of Poor St. Angela. All right, Jillian. And Jillian's going to tell us her answer. Is it letter A, letter S, letter Q, or letter W? It's definitely letter Q because I believe that that would be the best answer. Or that would be the best choice to do in that certain situation because it would benefit both the parties involved and it would not sacrifice the friendship, the trust, and the good relationship that we had formed through the years. All right. Thank you, Jillian. Thank you. And thank you. What happens next? And now, we have... Angelica Rotoni of Four St. Irene. What's your answer? Q. Q? Yes. Why Q? It's because, as a friend, I don't want to have a tension-filled peer group. And I want to have love in that peer group, peace, like that. So I would try to help them solve their problem. What is the essence of a woman? Uh, a woman, she needs to be cared, taken care of, like that. <laughs> what happens next is up to you. Now we're going to hear from two of St. Scholastica Marikina's finest. We have... Nicole Bernadette of Four St. Angela. And... Rosella Lacanlale from Four St. Veronica. Okay, now we're going to hear from... The most. <laughs> <laughs> what are their answers? Letter A, letter S, letter Q, or letter W? I would choose letter Q because I wouldn't want to see my friends falling apart. And to be a good friend is to be a bridge that connects two islands that are once together. I will also pick letter Q because I both love them, so I will not let anything destroy our friendship. Alright, there you have it. What happens next is up to you. Keep watching Inside the Fishbowl.